Hi, I'm Jennifer with Prexion. In this video, I will show you how to capture a small 5x5 field of view scan. This size scan is commonly used to capture two to three teeth for a single implant site to check for an impacted tooth and also used for endo. Excelsior console, select the small scan mode plus the quality of the image and the patient size. Click check scan area, enter your operator name and reason for taking the scan. In this example, we will use site of tooth number three. Click OK. The scanner initialization will begin. Please make sure no one is near the scanner as the machine will rotate. Prior to bringing the patient to the scanner, it is important to know the site to be acquired. If the site of concern is on the mandible, use the chin rest adjustment arrows to bring the chin rest disc into the lower part of the field of view box. If the site of concern is on the maxilla, lower the chin rest approximately two centimeters. Have the patient stand in front of the scanner. Using the gantry adjustment arrows on the small console screen, adjust the gantry until the chin rest disc is level to the patient's mandible. Now, looking at the highlighted field of view box, use the arrows located on the lower left of the small console screen to adjust the vertical line to the site of concern. In this case, we will aim for the site of tooth number three. Take a sagittal preview by holding down the exposure switch. Once the sagittal preview appears, verify that the site of concern was captured within the green field of view highlighted box. Using the arrows to the right and left of the field of view box, readjust if necessary and retake a scout image to verify positioning. Once you verify that your positioning is correct in the sagittal view, click the front tab to rotate the gantry to the coronal position. Using the coronal adjustment arrows, position the vertical line at the site of concern. Please note the highlighted box should be positioned to the patient's right, center, or left, depending on the site to be acquired. In this case, we are capturing tooth number three, so it is on the patient's right side. Hold down the exposure switch to take a coronal preview and verify that the site of concern was captured, or readjust the blue vertical line and retake a coronal preview. Now, click to scan. Once the scan is complete, allow the machine to come to a complete stop before safely removing your patient away from the scan. For more training videos, click here to watch this video that shows you how to capture a 15 by 13 scan, this video which shows you how to capture a full arch scan, and this video that shows you how to capture a panoramic image. If you do not already own a Prexion 3D scanner and would like more information, please visit our website with the link provided in the description below to contact your local Prexion 3D representative.